right, thank you for visiting. In this uh, video, it's the second video of a series on uh, installing WordPress. Now I'm going to go under the assumption that you've already installed WordPress over on your hosting plan over at USAVE Domains. You've done the one-click automated installation. Um, if you haven't done that yet, I recommend going and watching the video. Uh, the video should be over here on the right side margin of our home page. We should have some videos over here. You'll probably see more by the time you watch this video. So you've already done your installation over at usavedomains.com on your hosting plan. Now you're ready to uh, go in and start working on your WordPress blog and setting up your theme. So I'm going to go up to the address bar and I'm going to go to my uh, website, the domain that I installed it on, and you'll see the default uh, WordPress theme that comes with WordPress. You'll scroll down to the bottom right hand corner and click login. I'm going to log in to my back end area. Um, this is the username and password that you used when you did the installation, so I hope you wrote it down. If you didn't, you can click lost it and it'll email it to you. And here's my back end admin section of WordPress. You'll see here on the left side margin there's some navigation buttons, some general information about my posts. But what I'm going to do here is to change my initial theme, I'm going to click on Appearance. I'm going to click on Themes. Well, actually, it's right there. It's the first one that loads up. I'm going to click on Install Themes. And I'm going to just, you can choose some here and search for them, but you can also go to um, newest and you'll see a bunch of different options appear on your screen now there's a lot of themes out there so you already get an option of installing hundreds and hundreds of themes based around different looks and categories um, everything you could think of but there's also a lot of uh, themes that are for sale out there um, some really nice themes out there, but let's say you want to just work with one of the standard ones. So, actually, I'm going to go choose this one, the Chip Life. You can preview it if you want. I'm going to just click Install. I'm going to click Install now. And it's installing on the back end. You're not seeing anything happen just yet. Once it's installed, I'm going to want to activate my theme. Now it's going to unpack it. And that's my current theme now. I can always change my theme and go back to the one I had before. If I want, I can just scroll down and click Activate, and it'll wipe out the previous one and install the default one. Or I can go back up here and choose a new one if I don't like it. But it's installed, and if I want to preview it, I can just go up here to click on my domain name and it's going to load up the theme. Here it comes. And there it is. There's my new blog. Already professionally uh, done. It looks nice. It's clean. And I can start working on it. Now if I want to get back to my admin section, all I have to do is let's see here. I go back to bottom right hand corner again and I click site admin and now I'm back at my dashboard so I can start posting I can start working on things over here is the posts there's some other information here but I'll add these to other videos um, but that's it for now and that's how you can uh, set up your theme for your WordPress blog over at usavedomains.com. Now if you like the video, you think it's beneficial and you think it would help other people, wherever you're watching it, if there's a plus or a plus sign or a thumbs up sign, please give us a thumbs up. It lets other people know about us. Also maybe if you're a Facebook member, please give us a like on your Facebook page. That lets other people know about us. Alright, thank you and remember that there are other videos over here on the right side margin. Thanks and I'll be adding more later. Alright, bye bye.